Hello, ladies and gentlemen, it's me once again, your friendly neighborhood Pokeprof, here with some more Hearthstone. It's not exactly the arena, but with the smaller, smaller, much smaller space I have on my computer, um, I'm only going to be doing recording not all that well, to be honest. I'm actually here, joined with one of my other friends who got into the beta as well, the Killer Bunny Rabbit. Demon Bunny, thank you. I like to call you the Killer Bunny Rabbit, because that's pretty much what any kind of Demon Bunny is. That's alright. But yeah, um, I'm planning slash hoping to get a external hard drive soon, which will allow me to be a lot more free with my recordings, but until then... It's going to be fairly bite-sized chunks, but for now, me and my friend are going to be doing some battling. And your real name is being shown here, Bunny. Are you wanting me to it's fine. censor that out later or nah? It's up to you. I'll censor it out just because i rather not you be seen. Uh, just for protection purposes. No problem. But we're going to start off with completely random decks. I have a random druid, and I believe you have a random shaman, correct? Correct. Yes. This is going to be fun. For those of you who are watching this who don't know what a random deck is, essentially there is an option within um, Hearthstone to basically tell the game to just automatically finish a deck depending on how many cards you have left. A random deck essentially says to do that right off the bat with just no cards in your deck. And you can get absolutely crappy cards for what you need. Alright, I'll end my turn. Boop, boop, boop. I'm not sure if it's actually... Um, oh. Ow. I'm not sure if it's Hearthstone or if it's Fraps, but I'm lagging here a bit. Did you end your turn? Yep. Oh, no, no, I have it. Now I ended it. I was going to say, because it's like... What's going on? I got distracted by touching the map. For the wild. Your piggy is dead. That's not very nice, sir. And... Do I want to do this? Now wait. Here, move. And then I grab a stone, and then I throw it at your face. Oh, and I hit a murloc as you summoned one. <laughs> no damage. Let's see. Three. You know what? Let's do this. They'll never know what Ooh. Nice. Yep. Oh, crap. Four. Ow. A 4-4 to start the match off. Believe it or not, there are actually a lot of players who really dislike this card. Let's see what to do, what to do. What to do. Oh Jesus. Keep forgetting about that rock fighter weapon. That's actually cost me a few matches against the shaman. Really? Really? Yes, a totem, really. I wasn't talking about that, but let's see. Let's do this. Give me one more mana crystal to play around with in the future. Cheater! Well, that's the whole thing about the Druid, is that they can actually get themselves a lot more Mana Crystals through Invigorate and through Wild Growth. I actually played against this one Druid who, if my memory serves me correctly, ended up with like uh, two or three more mana than I did by the end of the game. I am ready to learn. He got out like a his 8-8 Protector on like turn 5 or something like that. I am ready to learn. Oh, joy. Really? You're gonna get... Uh, I'm getting some really hard cards. I feel your pain. Well, this these are the random decks, so... True. 
Haha, <laughs> random murloc, what the frick? <laughs> Let's see. For the wilds. Oh crap. I can't wait to actually get to my real decks here. But still, that's actually a fairly powerful card if you have a lot of spells, which apparently you have in spades. Remind me next time to kill your air totem. I am ready to learn. Oh, uh, really? You get the one totem that's gonna really help you. I think your random deck's beaten mine. I haven't really played much besides that girl. Are you ready for this? You've got all these huge cards. I've got nothing past the forecaster so far. True, but huge cards mean nothing if you could just throw every single little one at me. I guess. I have too many minions. <laughs> yeah, you gotta start sacking some. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I guess it prevents things like a magic where people could just make these huge armies. Sure. Now imagine if you were having like a um one of the like the Stormwind Commander out on the same time as um as all those little guys. Oh yeah. We extra cut off. Let's get rid of you. For the wild. Let's ping you. Got noisy dogs in the background. Sorry about that, folks. Nothing I can do about the noisy dogs. They very stupid at times. <laughs> I, well, you can understand the same thing. You, you got two noisy little yappers of your own. That I do. Well played. Ah, oh, really? Does that actually kill me? Oh, yeah, that does win Fury. Good game. Yeah, good. Yeah, right. I forgot the totems got the boost power up. I was trying to find a way to win. And then I remembered, hey, they get plus three attack too. I keep on forgetting that with a shaman, if they have a bloodlust near the end of the game and have a like at least, even like just two or three cards that could be insta death for a lot of people all right let's go with the real decks now i've got my warrior deck ready to tear something into ya oh gosh well thank you for telling me what it is <laughs> oh like you're going to be able to build a deck that counters mine right off the bat you i wasn't going to build leave. anything lotar ogar Garrosh versus it actually lasted not as long as I thought it would be. Wow, that is one of the most awful hands I've ever seen. I feel your pain. More yapping. More bad cards on my end. Oh, at least I got some better cards. I think they really gotta change out the, um... The shuffle system? Yeah, they need to make it a little bit more random because I can't tell you how many times I've gone and thrown a card away into my back into my deck only to have it draw like right back again for the mulligan or with um, like the first two draws or so. Yeah. Let's see. So you're doing that. Wow. I've got f two copies of some of my most valuable cards already in my hand. Uh, let's just do this. Also, I love 
the Stormwind um, map here for Hearthstone more than any other map. You want to know why? it has a bunch of breakable items on it? Yeah. Essentially, it's like for any Horde player, it's like, oh, hey, let's wreck up all of Stormwind by breaking absolutely everything. I mean, it's quite literally, it's like with Ogremar's map, it's very much a, oh, cool, we get to have nice little things that you can interact with. With Stormwind, it's you break absolutely everything and you bother their mounts. All right, you know what? Let's do this. Not the best taunt in the world, but seven health for four mana, that's kind of scary. And then you come around with Assassinate, because you're a frickin' rogue. Assassinate costs five mana. Oh, that's right. I'm still trying to realize what all the cards do and who does what and everything. No problem. The one I'm probably the most familiar with is Priest. Uh, priest, your main deck? One of my mains. I actually kind of, I actually dest destroyed my old Priest deck because it wasn't working all that well. And uh, I need to make a new one. I need to get more Priest cards. I've actually been getting a lot of Warrior cards, which is why I have a Warrior deck now. Warrior and Shaman is a lot of what I've been getting, actually. It's like, I actually didn't think I would like Shaman all that much because of the whole overload mechanic. Yeah. Really? Ah, uh, freaking backstab. Let's see. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Yeah, chill, Yeti. Job done. Don't make the Yeti angry. You won't like him when he's angry. Okay. Really? Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, trolling frickin' rogues. Head crack. Ugh. And then there's more glitching of the... The face-down card when you return it? Yeah. I always thought that was kind of cool. I didn't realize it was a glitch. It, Yeah, it's most likely a glitch. I uh, like it because it reminds you that you returned a card. And yeah, it doesn't go do away until you play that card. Ooh, I've never seen that color of card before. Yeah, the unique cards for, like, every class is color-coordinated. So it's, for example, a warrior-only card is red, a rogue-only card is black, stuff like that. So it's like, I can't get head crack or sap. It's like, um, the only class I know of that in the entire game that can actually get, um abilities from other classes is the priest because of like thought steel and mind vision and whatnot. Yeah. Also you're gonna hate me for this. Silence I <laughs> kill you Job done. Oh, ow, you killed my Iron Beak, ow. I'm so depressed and sad. Wow. Now that's just frickin' annoying. I have noticed your deck is fairly light on minions. Oh, the... I'd rather not use the Deadly Poison, but I wanted to get her buffed up and go out. 
Right. Well, I'm going to do this. And then this. And then say goodbye to that. And... that. I got so low health. Telling me. At least you've got a handful of cards. Well, most of them are cards I've been trying to be waiting to play. Most of them are actually the same thing. Alright. Done. Wow, I'm finally on the board with some damage. Some good damage, too. Yeah, five damage in one turn, that's nothing to compare to your frickin' bloodlust. <laughs> but it's a bloodlust, you can't say anything about that. True. Still, it's like, I, I can't tell you how many games I've seen where it's just like, Oh yeah, bloodlust, I take you down from 30 health! You remember that game I told you about, right? Oh yeah. That was Did you hilarious. Have like 50? Yeah, I had 50 because I was my warrior. I had 30 health and 20 armor. And then it's like, oh yeah, I have bloodlust and an entire field of minions. And I just take you down like that. So many. He also had, um, what was it? Two of the berserkers. The Gurubashi berserkers. And those had already had, like, a few buffs, so it's like they were each hitting for, like, 10 and 11. And I think he even Wind Furied one of them as well, so that all that on top of the Bloodlust buff was like, yeah. That was when I was, like, doing, like, a really heavy melee warrior deck where it was, like, all my warrior doing the job. So... Let's do that. It's like, I love how it gave me two cards that for your deck mostly has been absolutely useless. Oh, thanks. That head crack is an annoying card, I'll tell you what. Oh yeah, that's why I like it. And now you have two cards that are on the field that are just covering the board. I only can see one. Hmm. Let's see. Um, let's do this. You know what? Let's do this as well. The charge oh. card. Can you see the theme of my warrior deck here? Lots of charge and pain. Yep. I have my Warsong Commanders and my Charge, and of course you're fucking assassinate. But essentially, my deck's basically designed to go and smack you as much as I can. And it's actually gotten me some pretty good wins. It's not perfect by any stretch of the imagination, but it does pretty good. I think you have me. Unless I pull something fantastic next time. I think I win right here. Yeah, that... now you're gonna win. Can we finally get rid of these cards that are just stuck on the screen? Please. Ding! And I get a golden heroic strike. Too bad I never use them. Alright, how much time have we been going on for? And about 15, almost 20 minutes. I'd say we have time for one more. You got a third deck ready up? Yep. All right. Let us do it. My main deck. Orc versus Orc. Your soul shall be mine. 
The Doom Hammer. Hmm. You know, this is actually a pretty good hand. I'll stick with this. So, have you gotten Jaraxxus for um, your Warlock deck yet? Mm, no, but I got some Flame Imps and a Summoning Portal. Ooh, Summoning Portals. I love those for the I actually warlock. made the Summoning Portal in the Creation Zone. Mm. I had enough stuff yeah. from my one arena. Okay, I'm gonna do this. Give yourself plus three? Yep. Oh, that's interesting. I didn't know you could give it to yourself. Yep, you can. It's like you're gonna be smacking me with that flame imp anyway, so it might as well just only take it once and kill a flame imp. I know that. Do I have enough mana? No, I don't, so let's just summon my knife juggler. Yeah, I need to get back to my Warlock Arena. I have one from, like, I started a month or so ago. Maybe more. I saw. And I haven't touched it since, mainly because a combination of me being busy and me just not having that much room on my computer to try and do more arena -ing. Maybe after I've put this one video up, I'll go ahead and do that. So, let's see. Uh, let's do this. Ooh, nice. Throw the knife. And then, just like that. And you know what? Let's do this as well. Yay, free mana! And I've got a healing totem that can smack you in the face. You always seem to have those. Ah, dang it. Really? <laughs> what? I got rid of your Dread Infernal for it, but still. I believe you were the one who commented that it's not a very good card anyways. Eh, it, Dread Infernal's alright. <laughs> It's situational, let me say that much. That's for sure. It's like, I've seen Dread Infernals win a game. Either because it's a 6-6 six, six monster which is scary in and of itself, and just wrecks face, and then other times because of the, that one damage just wipes the entire enemy board. I'm not pulling any good cards right now. That happens. This healing totem, if you were actually here um, before they changed it in a patch, um, it was actually kind of really overpowered. Because it actually used to heal the shaman as well as his oh, wow. minions. Yeah, overpowered indeed. Yeah. Um. Let's do this. To Northrend. For honor, victory or death. Or in my case, both. I need to play some more Arams. <laughs> I'm sorry. I love that ghost guy. Especially when you're a Yordle. He always complains when you're a Yordle. But, oh, yeah, actually, that kind of... Surprising, that reminds me. Um, I looked at the map. Ow. There goes my healing totem. Uh, but you remember how I was t comparing this map with the... Um, with the map over on Stormwind? It's like... You don't kill or destroy anything on this map. You just fool around. The only really aggressive thing you can do is, like, throw the boulder and that's it. But it's like, on Stormwind, you just destroy everything. That's for sure. 
I'm really not pulling anything worth my while today. Pass me that arc light spanner. Yeah. Oops, that was a mistake. Wrong card. Yep. That was a mistake. Big time wrong card. Sorry that happened. You've got me. I can't defend against you and you gonna win this turn. Yeah, that life tap was a mistake. <laughs> if you would have won anyways. Mm, well, not this turn. I wouldn't have won that turn. Also, I love the golden. Uh, actually, scratch that. I would have. You know why? I just top deck this. See, you would have won anyway. <laughs> I love For that. Jakey, you'd have something to give your guys a little boost. Yeah, well, I like that. It's like for the alliance, and yet I'm playing a horde character. Let's say <laughs> this. Oh well. Maybe you'll get a better draw next time. We should do this when we have some more different cards and maybe different decks. I gotta remake my priest deck. I also gotta get my brother's decks off of this. Because he's got two of them. Are they bad? One's a hunter, one's a rogue. The hunter's fairly bad. I haven't tried the rogue because I don't like rogues. But anyway, that was just me and the demon bunny doing some hearthstone. We'll probably do some more. I'm not sure how soon we will, but he wanted to show off some of his decks. I wanted to show off some of mine, and I will eventually get back to that, this arena run. So, until then, everyone, we'll catch you next time.